I think itong uh, week of prayer ay malaking bagay sa akin personally. Uh, dahil dito ko napatunayan na kung paano magre-refine sa iyo ang Panginoon sa pananampalataya mo. Uh, I can count how many times uh, nag-attempt ako na ibalik yung yung assignment kay doon sa nag-assign sa akin. But then, God uh, would always remind me na uh, yung task na binigay niya sa akin ay hindi ako kailangan hindi ako ang kailangan gumawa kundi siya. And uh, as the week of prayer is getting closer um, na-anxious ako okay? but uh, God would give me peace uh, dun sa preparation ko yung process ng preparation talagang uh, na-refine talaga yung faith ko. Kasi especially when I uh, I learned the lesson no, from from the message. Kasi unang-una ako talaga ang ang na natouch dun sa message na yun. Uh, so because of that message na-realize ko na when God calls you to do something He will use that Okay, as an opportunity really to refine your faith. And ako ang unang-unang nag-benefit doon sa message na yun. At na-experience ko kung paano ako na-refine ang Panginoon. That's why deep inside me talagang I was crying to God. I was telling Him, Lord, thank you. Thank you for this opportunity. Kasi kung hindi mo pinigay sa akin itong opportunity, opportunity na to, hindi ko alam kung Uh, hindi ko alam kung may opportunity pa ulit na ibibigay mo sa akin kung uh, mararanasan ko yung ganitong pag-refine ng ating ito. So, sa atin, sa mga kabataan, uh, kapag kayo ay tinawag ng Panginoon, huwag kayo maghilinlangan kasi ang Panginoon ang mahala sa inyo. Siya yung mag-empower sa inyo. and difficult for me to focus. Before I accepted this ministry as part of the program committee, um, I accepted it gladly in my heart. And um, one time, I was uh, no, questioning in my mind, uh, since this is a big responsibility for me to handle, I, I, uh, I asked a question. What could be the challenge or the trial that I would face along the way? And I did not expect that it would be, it would cost me a lot of burden and broke. It would cost me um, a lot of brokenness in my heart because it affects not just the ministry that I'm going to do and perform right now, but also my relationship with others. Starting from the month of February and this past few week of March, um, my relationship with God is not so good. Attending worship is really hard for me because I was so broken hearted. But God he is so amazing and good because He is able to refine my heart. Now, even though I am not qualified in doing this ministry, But he has called me because he is able to qualify me. Now everything w- went well. And from the previous um, message, this um, this message that the speaker, um, I think it's from the Monday, Monday topic, na Enoch lived by faith. So I was trying to say, Clarice, live by faith. Walk by faith with God. I hope that you also is going to 
um, dedicate your time, your effort only to God because He is willing to refine you wholeheartedly. God bless.